Hello lovely people all over the world! Welcome to my channel, I'm Veronica from Me Paintings and today I will be making another little experiment with these lovely colors and I'll be doing something extra special but I am gonna show you that later on. Firstly, I would like to thank these these amazing people who very kindly sponsored me so I was able to create this video for you because without your support I couldn't make these videos it's so much work and so much it's so time consuming so your support is crucial to, to me and you are so amazing thank you so much to all these people who very kindly sponsored me so now I can start explaining what I did I mixed my colors I'm using this white this will be on the top and then it will be this this is very dark teal and I mixed these colors this um, uh, phthalo blue and phthalo green and that created this color then this is the phthalo blue and then I've got my violet and also this red or Bordeaux color this one is mixture of rose, madder and violet if I say that right my white is titanium white and I mix these colors are quite good because you don't have to use too much of them they are quite thick so I used 30% uh, of colors and 70% uh, of pouring medium see it is quite thick but that's how it should be I think and I mix my own pouring medium from glue and water I use 60% of glue and 40% of water I put it in this bottle so it's easy to squeeze in my colors and my base is 100% acrylic just 100% acrylic titanium white which I bought in local art shop it is this acrylic is quite thin and I hope it will be okay if not I'll create something different never mind so let's put this aside because now it's time to show you something I don't have any spinning thing at home and I don't like spending too much money basically because I don't have these funds but that's good because I can create something by myself from things which I have got at home so I went to my kids stuff and they have got this Lego and they have got this turning thing so I'm just gonna put it here and it turns like this see so let's put this uh, on here very easy so, um, oh, wrong angle and now one thing the other thing and voila here's my turning spinning thing <laughs> so i will be trying to spin my canvas on this and we'll see what it creates so that's quite fun you know you can always work with something you've got at home just be a little bit creative i like to be creative <laughs> And now we can start pouring. I hope I hope I explained everything. So it's very easy. The base is 100% acrylic color. They sell it. They just put it in the jar. They I I can bring my jar and then they spill it in my jar. And I tell them how much I want. So that's 100% acrylic color. Let's put it here. All covered. Now I'm gonna spill a little bit of my white in the middle as well. Just a little bit in the middle. Here we go. And I forgot one quite important thing. I will be putting a little bit of this gloss varnish in my colors. It's a spray which I usually put on the top of my paintings when they get dry but now I'm just gonna squeeze a little bit in each color just one one squeeze it 
helps with cells. Now you can just mix it a little bit, not too much, just a little bit. Okie dokie, let's start. I'm gonna... hmm. Firstly, my Bordeaux color. Purple, blue, teal, and my white. this whoops and let's blow that ooh nice nice color combination No visible cells, but I think it will create something interesting. I'm gonna use my torch now. <clears throat> it is creating some interesting cells. It is a lovely combination of colors. Looks like flower now. I think my cells will grow when I turn it. So let's put it here. And I'm just gonna put these things away. I'm just gonna move it a little bit in the middle but it's looking so cool not exactly perfect cells but I like it I like the way it ended up it reminds me butterfly or something like that I'm gonna use my torch again Ooh, some cells popping. Mm, nice. Oh, look at this. Okay, look at this beauty. Love these. Some very nice cells and these cells are still growing, so I think it will still grow. Oh, look at this beautiful cells. Here, teeny tiny cells growing. This looks like a galaxy. Hey, so welcome back. My pour is finally dry and I love, love, love how this turned out. I love all the cells and depth. I like these cells, it looks like um, some kind of galaxy tornado or something like that. Actually, when you look at it, you can see many interesting things in it. So here in this, in this stage, I see a galaxy tornado and when I turn it like this, can you see something? 
Well, I can see a beautiful tree. This is a trunk and here are the branches. Or when you turn it like this, can you see something? Please let me know in the comment below if you see something in it because it, I would be very interested in your ideas. What can you see? I can see a beautiful flower here. Can you see it too? And I think lots of you can see what I see and what I will be painting on it. I can see a beautiful dancing ballerina with a beautiful dress. I can already see the dress and it's so beautiful. So I'm going to paint my little dancing ballerina and I will, I'm going to show you how to do that. So firstly, I'm going to draw some uh, ballerina lines uh, so I can see where it will be. And then I will start uh, working on shading and little details. So I'm going to paint from big things to a smaller things to big details. So here she is, my dancing ballerina. And I love how she blends with this poor. I know she's not perfect, I've got loads and loads of things to improve, but I hope I gave you an idea, I hope I inspired you to create very interesting art and I just love all, all of this, all, all these movement and well, she, she she doesn't have to be ballerina. She could be a dance dancer, flamenco dancer, or I don't know. I just I just love how this turned out, and I hope you enjoyed it. I hope I inspired you to create your own beautiful art. Thank you very much for watching, and if you like it, please give it a thumbs up or subscribe to my channel where you can see many more interesting videos, or you can also hit the bell and receive notification every time I upload a new video, or you can also join my Facebook group where you can show me your beautiful creation. Thank you very much for watching and see you soon. Bye!